Hey, what is up guys? So we're gonna be unboxing three packs of the Breakers of Shadow, which is basically the best booster pack that we're gonna be getting in a long time, boys. So, uh, this comes out next week. Shout out to my main man, Don, for sending me this from Konami. But uh, anyways, guys, let's go and crack it open. If you guys haven't seen my video already to show what are the best cards in this set, I'll link it down below. But there are things for fan favorite, uh, like Buster Blader support, and there's also some BLS stuff in here. But the main thing is that there are some crazy pendulums in here. Ariadne is in here. We got the wizard. There are some great cards in here. And in addition to that, there's a foil out of every set. I feel like I'm trying to sell you guys a set. But the thing is, like, honestly, this is one of the best sets. So we got the Trump Girl as the first card. We got the Super Heavy Samurais. We have another Super Heavy Samurai. This is a prep defense. We have Twilight Ninja. So it's kind of cool to get some ninja support. I know a lot of people like that deck. So for our rare, we got Goyo King. For our Ultra, we got the Buster Dragon. So, going back to what I was mentioning before, that Buster Blader support, you turn everything into dragons, and then basically you can destroy your opponent if they have dragons, <laughs> which this card's gonna make them all become. Uh, uh, next up, we have a new Blackwing support. There's the uh, Harmaton, the Dust, Dark Doriato. There is a FTK with this card. If you guys are interested in doing some cheesy Yu-Gi-Oh plays, I'll also link that down below in the description box. And we have the Shurenus. So they are samurai sync, well they're, they're not really samurais, but uh, they are like zombies, I want to say they're, they're zombie spirits, uh, that uh, it's more so of a synchro deck, so if you guys are interested in synchros, definitely will have access to busting more synchros out. But uh, I don't think the Shrenus are going to be competitive, um, as of right now there's not that much support. Same thing with the ninjas, if you want to be competitive, I'm sure you already know about the Ariadne deck which uh, I will also link down below in the description box if you guys want like a deck profile of the, like, the most powerful deck right now in the game. But next back, we got another Twilight Ninja. We got the Cosmo Delta Shuttle. We got the Shuriken of Samurai. Then there's the Twilight Ninja Getsuga, the Shogun. And then for our super, we got oh, Buster Welp, the Destruction Swordsman. So a lot of these small cards you actually use to make, uh, well, you can, um, this card is normal, so you can add a destruction sword, which is going to be helping you with your uh, Buster Bladers. But um, you can attribute to special one a Buster Blader from your hand or graveyard. And so you can get quick access to bust out the Buster Blader, because, yeah, he's kind of hard to summon uh, if you don't. Uh, next up, we have the Perform Pal Rain Goat. We have the Dynamis Stegosaur. Uh, we have the Super Heavy Samurai General Jade and the Dynamis Brachion. If you guys don't know what Dynamis do, uh, we don't have all the support for the deck yet, but. Uh, there is some more support coming out in the future and they revolve around uh, Like if your opponent would bottomless your stuff or do anything to your pendulums You can instead like destroy another card. So our last pack. Let's go So hopefully what I'm trying to ho hopefully pull from this is I really want a twin twister That's a fantastic card in this set um, Just great in like any deck. So next up we have the Ceratops we have the Plesios, we have the Bit Bite Turtle, we have the Dragon Buster Destruction Sword, so another one of those like chibi monsters. We have Arsene Gaia the Fierce Knight, oh and another, dude, I got double ultras in three packs. We have the Shiranui uh, Shogun Saga, that is freaking awesome. At first I was looking up most of the cards, I'm like, ah, maybe I'll build that uh, Buster Blader. Next up we have Draco Face Off. Um, this in the OCG, if you guys didn't know, it was, it's the Clash of the Draco Rivals. This is one of like the craziest cards. Uh, this is very, very powerful card. Then we have the Shurnu Smith uh, over here. And then we have another Harmonon, the Dust. So let's go ahead and do a quick little recap of what we got here. So I'm going to show off the Ultras and the, uh, well, all, all the foil cards and of course the rares. Because that's what most of you guys like to see anyways. Now that freaking, I love how we get foils in every pack now. That is pretty sweet. If you guys didn't know, that's uh, from now on going forward. So, for our Ultras, we got the Buster Dragon. We also got the Shrinu Shogun Saga. Then for our Supers, we got one of the uh, Buster Welp, the Destruction Swordsman. And of course, you still get a rare in every pack. So we got Goyo King, we got Getsuga, and we got Arisen Gaia the Fierce Knight. Hopefully they'll get more support. I think they're getting a few more cards down the line. Uh, we got Shining Victories in the future, but anyways guys, let me know what was your favorite card or what your favorite archetype is in this set. Personally for me, uh, I really want to see more support for BLS. That's one of my favorite cards, uh, but uh, we'll have to wait and see in the future. But anyways, thanks for watching guys, and I'm signing out.